Monday, May 29th, 2023. I sit here. About to go to bed. Memorial Day. I asked for prayers yesterday from my cousin and his family. And I do appreciate any prayers that were offered up. The events that happened really led to be uh, led to a somber weekend. But you know, I talk about making the best of things. Surely I did. Thought of my cousin a lot, the struggles he's going through. His wife passed away. Vehicle left the road. At this point, we don't really know the details. Can't say they really matter. The detail that matters is their little boy. He's made it out of that without serious injury, which is a godsend in its own. They got a long road ahead of them. Yeah, that little boy right there on the cliffside. There's me as a little boy, and he's up there with me. See him up above. Yeah, I didn't give you very good lighting for that, but I've shown him before, too. Yeah, he's a couple years older than me. You know, you grow up, and my cousins were around, you know, and when you have birthday parties or you're going somewhere, the, he was like the one I always look forward to seeing. You know, and I think a lot of us, and probably a lot of you who might see this, probably have had something like that. And it's likely not all of you have, but I'm sure some of you have. And I'm sure that whether it be someone you looked up to or someone that looked up to you or both, you know, those things, I mean, childhood memories, well, they've carried over into you know, care and love and adult life. The adult life, of course, has not brought us any closer. Cool cat, my cousin. Yeah, we all cool in some sort of way. But, you know, that childhood and admiration and a little nostalgia and a backstory I won't get into of faith and love, yeah, trials and pain. We all got stories. Went all that long ago. Week and a half, maybe. Couldn't say for sure, my memory sucks. Had a tough day, tough night of sleep. Go into the shop, planned to go late, but you know, I had a truck going out. Figure I better be there. 
showed up, made sure the truck went out, no problems. Never did punch in and sat there in the chair and slept. Took me a nap. Old man shows up, takes me out for some breakfast at the old Mickey D's. Oh, there she was. Seemed to brighten her day seeing me there, saying hi and giving hugs. I mean, it did brighten my day. Looking at it now. I'm very thankful. I got that one last chance myself. Pleasant surprise that day. <sighs> and something today that I look at, I'm grateful for. So I don't always know what to do. And I went out and bought, bought some vegetation and transplanted it into a nice little pot. Something I thought would be tasteful and easy to place somewhere. Put those plants in it from my cousin. And my somber weekend. I just make my heart go out to him more. Prayers, further prayers, definitely appreciated. I won't go too deep into the story. It's really not my place to go too deep into all that. I've said enough. But for those of you who have prayed, you may be seeing this now. If you're a prayer warrior, you know. My hope and my prayer is that God remains with his hands on my cousin's son and my cousin himself too and that may, my cousin may see that either way be comforted and help through this hard time somber chill I asked for prayers, and, uh, yeah, you know, a lot of you strangers, <laughs> yep, but I appreciate it all the same, if you cared enough to do it, and for that, I, I feel I owed you some sort of update. And with that, I think I'll leave it. Y'all take care. You know, cherish every moment we got. Shit, up, shit, shit hits the fan every day for people. Somewhere, any given moment. Things can change. And it only takes a moment. For your world to change completely. Completely.